this is a continuation of the previous video that I have posted earlier about electromagnetic induction. So what is actually electromagnetic induction? It is the process by which changing magnetic field in a conductor induces a current in it is called as electromagnetic induction. Let's see this diagram. We'll do an activity. Take a coil of wire having many turns. We can see here that a coil has been taken with many turns. Now we will connect it to a sensitive galvanometer. Galvanometer is one which measures current. So here we can see a galvanometer connected to the wire and which is a closed circuit. So the galvanometer will be pointing wherever the current flows. Now take a bar magnet and move the north pole of the magnet towards the coil. See uh, here is the north pole and we will move towards the north pole. So we will move this side. So coming to the next slide. See what you will be observing from this experiment is that the galvanometer will give a deflection in a specified direction. If we move the north pole of the magnet away from the coil, we will observe that the galvanometer will give a deflection in the opposite direction. Similar effect will be observed if we use south pole of the magnet in the above activity. Again, if we move the, towards south pole, then the direction of uh, deflection will be reversed. So when the coil and magnet are both stationary, if we keep it uh, total stationary without moving it in any direction, there will be no deflection in the galvanometer. And if there is no deflection in galvanometer means there is no current. So whenever there is a relative motion or there is some movement between the coil and the magnet, it induces a current in the coil. Now what was the summary of the activity? If we put a magnet at rest, no deflection. If we put the magnet moving either in a north pole direction or in south pole direction, there will be a deflection in a specified direction. If magnet is stayed stationary, then no deflection. If magnet is stayed stationary at the same position away from the coil, no deflection. So here is the summary of the activity. Now what is a solenoid? As you can see from this diagram, a solenoid is a coil of many circular turns of insulated copper wire wrapped closely in the form of cylinder it is known as solenoid. Now magnetic field due to current in a solenoid. So when, a, uh, when we pass current through a solenoid, it behaves as a magnet same magnet as same similar to a bar magnet so let's see how how does the magnetic field um, due to current carrying uh, current in a solenoid looks as the magnetic field due to a solenoid is very much similar to that of a bar, bar magnet the pattern of the magnetic field lines around current carrying solenoid is similar to that of bar magnet just like a bar magnet, one end of the solenoid behaves as a magnetic north pole, other end behaves as a south pole. The field lines inside a solenoid are in the form of a parallel straight lines. Even if, uh, if we put replace a solenoid by a bar magnet and observe the same magnetic field lines inside a bar magnet will also form same parallel straight lines. This indicates that the magnetic field is same at all points inside a solenoid or inside a bar magnet. That is, the field is uniform inside the solenoid. I will be continuing with the chapter electromagnetism in the next video. Thank you.